When students return later this month, this 41,000 square foot building will house the business school and several health related classes. This is a strategic move. These Concordia University students excited to see where they'll be spending a lot of time this year, especially sophomore Katie Sanborn. So what do you think of the new space? Honestly, it's phenomenal. Like the chairs on the walls, all these different classrooms of how they're like multi-purposeful, like they're just, they're so cool. Katie is an undergrad in the healthcare administration program. In the last three years, Concordia saw enrollment in its master's program double. This building isn't just for students in healthcare administration. It's kind of a different model that doesn't exist. Assistant Professor of Business Eric Hollander, also the director of the healthcare administration program, says the building is designed for students to learn from each other. It's the merging and collision of healthcare and business. It's awesome. Students studying speech language pathology and other health science majors will work alongside students studying business. This clinic plays a crucial role. But this would be very similar to a clinical setting. This is stuff that's in the team room so they keep track, they know who's where, what's going on. Hollander says the space gives them the opportunity to bring in more majors over time, like social work and nursing. It's a unique situation, I think, for students to come into in a pivotal time in the nation's history from the healthcare, but also the business side. Students hope what they learn here sets them apart when it comes to finding a job. Kind of getting like a first hand of everything, like before I even go out to get an internship, I'm kind of overseeing of how everything works. The new building also houses a forensic science lab, a mock courtroom, and a fancy test kitchen. Corrine Zell, today's TMJ4.